Ladies and gentlemen, boys and gorls, borts and gorts, Michaels Gorts. and Schmeichels. Gorts. We have a deck critique by J Sizzle23, uh, and it's basically you. pretty pretty open ended. Jundasaur, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. You can play Counters Company with Elk Man. Mm. No. Anyway, the deck critique is uh, bonus points. It's Elders Evolution. We have to build around Elders Evolution, and we get bonus points for Voice of Resurgence. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? What do you think about that? I don't understand what you're doing. I have no idea what you're doing right now. You don't know? Uh... Yeah, good one. That's good. So, now we need four drops. Drag test can't legal? Dang. Some good four drops. Oh, well, Seath four drops not going to get an in-race forerunner. No, but it's the next step after Voice of Resurgence. Voice of Resurgence. Yeah. Hey, it's the next step after Voice of Resurgence. But do we want to go Bant instead? Hmm. What does Bant give us better? I don't know. That's the question. Ooh, questing Beast is nice. Oh, we are Pioneer, my dude. Something Sovereign? Uh... Uh... Pioneer. None of these are good. There it is. <laughs> which 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 one? That doesn't narrow anything down. Why is Oko's price going up since the band? Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. There you go. Nailed it. I wanna what is it what is it now? To be fair, the same thing happened with Field of the Dead. I mean, I think it's because other people are like, alright, well, it's been banned in standard, but I can still play it on the other formats, so I'll pick it up for them. La, 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 la. This Sphinx? This dude, Unesh? Unes child, we do need a six drop. Are there any undying or persist cards that are legal? No. So there's none of these creatures are are good. Nothing's gonna come back, right? Oh, literal third card. Oh, the Vampire Sovereign? <laughs> that, was just, that was just a bad Siege Rhino. <laughs> we could play 8 Siege Rhino dot deck. That's no, funny that you said so. literal third card. If you said second card, it could have been both literal second card or no, oh, third card. You're right. Never mind. Damn it. I'm a dummy. Um, Everybody dude. knows that. I hate you so much. No. Oh. This deck's really hard to when you don't know the. Uh... There we go. We got that satch. Okay. Oh god. Jesus God. That's better. There, yeah, sure, it's good too. All right. This hard, I was gonna say this deck's a lot harder to make when you don't know the the format as well all I know is we need a six drop so we can get to our eight drop yes thraggy boy is illegal 
What are good six drops, my dude? I don't know. The Gearhawks? No, those are five drops. Noxious Gearhawk is a six drop. Is it? Too bad you can't put it in Master of the Wild. Wow. Wow. Cavaliers are five drops. Building decks is hard. <coughs> Shut up. You know, three abrupt decays? Mm -hmm. Yeah, what? why wouldn't I? I prefer the 2-2 two -two split. I don't. I don't want to give them lands. Fine. Maybe we'll need it. Maybe you'll be right. How do you feel about that? Put one on the board then. No, I'm good. Oh my god, I hate you. Why do you hate me? Because you your dad just left? Your you hate me? Just That's so fucked up, dude. Attitude. I'm sorry that your dad left, okay? I don't care about that, man. Yeah, you say that, but then I hear you crying in your room every night. Daddy, why did you leave? <laughs> Daddy... And it's just the saddest shit I've yeah, ever heard, that man. Doesn't, that doesn't happen, so. You know what? It does. Green snake god? Nah, the snake gods are shit. I don't like any of the gods. Oh, Ketra's good. I like that god. The green one's shit, though. What's the CMC of the Oketra? I wish we had Titans. They're all, they're both five. Okay. Oh, well, that's sad. We have Erebos' Titan. That's a 5-5. Five five. As long as your opponent controls no creatures, it has indestructible. This is a triple black. That's racist. Is it? I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> this deck is a lot harder than I thought it would be. I wonder if I should have an idea for this deck before I just jump right into it. Endbringer? Carnage Turn just doesn't impress me though. Like it's not like a card that I'm like I'm gonna search it up and then like really. It don't impress him much. Burp, burp, murder. It's true. <laughs> what does that thing do? It's not drowsy, Michael. It flips over and you get the top card. Yeah. If it's like a certain CMC, I'm just I'm just winging this here. Why are these showing up? Also, that makes their deck technically four colors. I, I don't understand why all these are showing up. Okay, now they're gone. Uh, what about like Land or Elf? Seems decent. Land or Elf, huh? Mm -hmm. Wow. Lana War Elf, he says. Or Goose Boy. Or Goose Boy. Biogenic Ooze. Eh. I like that you say Biogenic Ooze and you say eh. What's wrong with that? I don't know, because you dismiss your idea as soon as you say it. it wasn't my idea, I was reading the chat. Oh, I didn't know. I was listening to you. Well, maybe you should listen to the sound of the ocean. What? <laughs> Just saying, man. Are you? Silverheart? Like Wolfier Silverheart? It was fine. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Jesus can't save you now. Jesus can save everyone. Ender will save us all. That's a dashboard confessional song. I think. Nailed it.
dashboard confessional. Copyright incoming. Chris Caraba. Colossal. Oh, I like Dracu Seth actually. I guess I don't have any of that either. Can we throw out this junk and play Red Black Ilharg? No. What does that little guy do? This? Yeah. You don't know anything. Okay. So it's like pow, 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 pow. We do need five drops, though. Pop, 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 like, what will the five drops be? Pop, 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 pop. Why do we need five drops? Because that's how it works. You can get plus... Up oh, he's a seven drop. Okay. Well, that's why I like keeping things even, so you don't have to worry about that. You like things... What, even? Yeah. If we keep all our cards even, we can always jump up the ladder. Huh. What a smart guy. That's why the seven drop is awkward. Let's look up. Let's let's do some looking up, and then maybe we'll start the video over. For right now, we're just uh, okay. Type line creature: white, black, green. We'll say blue as well, just in case. At most, no, because then it's gonna be like it's gonna be like black blue cards and green blue cards and. Okay, at most these colors equal to six. Legal and Pioneer. Rarity, rare and mythic. I wanna look at the big I wanna look at the big bitches. The big, big bi booty bitches, that's <laughs> where it's at. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Uh our motto arm's pretty sweet. Did you know that Michael B will burn your throat? I had no I did not actually know that. It's true. Hey, I did not know that, you see. Man, how come no one liked my salami cat meme? I enjoyed it. I know, no one else does. Like, that's sad. Green, Wall Green Warden of Morasa is actually pretty sweet because you can get back the Eldritch Evolution. Oh, yeah, that's true. See, this is why we look up stuff. Big, 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 Marin, eh? No, no, no. Do I not have a Green Warden of Marasa? The things I do and don't have are really weird. Oh, I guess it would be here, though. Oh, it's one word? Green Warden is one word? Of course it is. And look, I got one. Okay. Jesus Christ. Moving on. Oh boy. Oblivion Seer is legal? Who? Oblivion Seer. What the hell's an Oblivion Seer? Oblivion Sower. Oh, did you say Seer? Yeah, I said Seer. Why did you say Seer? Because I, I bet it's called a mistake, Frank. Are you sure that's what it's like called? Like your birth. Like your birth. <laughs> so that's pretty good, man. That's pretty good. Don't ban me. It was close. That was a little bit <laughs> a little bit aggressive. Oh look, it's the it's the Titan that's not a Titan. No, the scuttling doom engine? Yeah. Or all these souls. I was talking about the scuttling doom engine. Well the souls are here too, my dude. The souls are here too. Why you just that repeat is where they lie. That's where they lie. The souls. Oh man, play that guy. This guy? No. No. Oh. On up. On up. Left. That guy. Terra Stomper? Yeah. <laughs> Terra Stomp him. God, Jesus. That guy's just worse than uh the other six drop, right? There's no eternal witness in this format, right? No. What are you insane? I don't know. Just what checking. do you think's the last time the thing's been printed, man? Not reasonably enough, I guess. Yeah, no, because I want I want Woodland Bellower to put it into to come into play, and then like to, to to search out another green creature that costs three or less, and put that into play, 
but without having like oh, one reclamation sage. Is it Night of Autumn just better? Yes. God, f far better. Okay, so... This is why... Thank you. This is why I kind of like having the... Curvaceous Kitty, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Welcome back. Appreciate it. Um, what were we looking for? Night of Autumn. Oh, yeah. I guess Night of is probably just literally worse than just writing Autumn. Michael B. Michael B. Michael B. Michael B. All right. So this is the problem, though, because you have Night of Autumn, so you kind of want five drops. I think we're just putting five drops in the deck anyway. We're not going to not put five drops in the deck. Casting cost five. I bet there's a cool. Sh oh, there's like Ravenous Chupacabra. That's a cool dude. Ravenous. Oh, that is a good one. And it's a four drop. So it's nice and even. Angel of Sanctions. Don't forget, you could, it's up to two. So you could actually sack a Seed Drowner to get like a, a five drop as well if you wanted to. Like an Angel of Sanctions. That's a good point. What about Blood Baron? What about one Blood Baron? Is that guy legal? Of course it is. Really? That's not enough either, huh? Blood Baroni. Blood Baroni. My Blood Baroni has a first name. It's, it's M-I-C-H-E-L. Wow, I was going to say Michael B. <laughs> That's, dear God, this is good. This meme is getting ridiculous. Do people want Find Broker? Find Broker? Golgari Find Broker? Yeah, it's not bad good. actually. No, it's actually pretty good. Golgari! I have 21 of them. Ooh. Why don't you brag about it? Shut up and take my money! Oh, I'm taking someone's money? Five? I'm so sorry, Bugs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> sorry, I forgive you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. It was just, I was really just surprised. I wasn't even mad, I was just disappointed. Uh, That's aggressive. Was it? I asked you a question. I said, was it? No, yeah, it was. No, yeah? No, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. What about this mystic Myriarch? Isn't that card like a weird thing? Look at this. Look at this beautiful piece of shit. Power and toughness is equal to twice the number of creatures you control. So if it's your only creature, it's a sweet 2-2 two -two for 5. Doesn't fly, even though it has wings. Cool. Oh, wait, hold on. If you control a creature with flying, it gains flying. And then first strike, double strike, death touch, haste, hexproof, indestructible life. Yeah, okay. Thank you for your... Th thank you for your service. Thank you for your service. What about Obzadad? Obzadaddy? Is that legal? This one is. Oh. I'm liking okay. this. Oh, all right. I'm getting, now I'm getting into it. I got a nice variety package here. What do I get? One Gitrog monster, one Tulsimir. One Frog Lord. I don't think he does anything in our deck, actually. I, I like the card, I just don't think it does anything. You know what I'm saying? There's also no fetch lands to go with it, so. Doom Whisper. Is there any other good two drops we can play? No, there's probably none. This is the only good two drop in the whole format. I haven't gotten to two drops yet, Michael. Crying out loud. Can you just slap? Like a rock. Can you just oh, wait? Oh, like a windmate rock. Virgil's Gear Hulk also not bad. No, that's fine. I'm actually gonna. I'm gonna put all the. Uh, Verdue. Is that not right? Verjuris. Verjuris. Okay. 
Maybe neck. We'll put one of them on everything and then kind of decide the numbers later. Yeah, that's what I think we're going to do. All right, now we're going to go to cover back cost of four. Nope. 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 This whole process is going to be long but fun, I think. Nothing. 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 We want things to really affect the battlefield when they come into play. You want an ETB triggers. But also cards that I don't really care if I sacrifice them. Like a Gonti would be sweet. We could play a Gonti. Woodland Bellower getting a Knight of Autumn is pretty sweet. I also want to see what other kind of three drops we'll have to. Look at this. Look at this thing. I've never even seen this thing before. Neither have I. Look at this gluttonous troll. This is obviously one of the the brawl deck cards that I've just never even seen. Look at this look at this creepy ass mouth. Yikes. He's gonna eat that chicken. Yeah. He's definitely gonna eat that he's definitely gonna eat that chicken. Look at all those chickens. Ooh, we could play one million hands. One million hands. <laughs> Polychronos is a decent toolbox option. No, Polychronos sucks. We're never going to have enough mana for that guy. I don't even care about Polychronos. Wow. Yeah, you heard me. What about Thought Knot? Nah, that makes the mana base worse. Yeah, because then you can never, like, cast it. Actually, Tristana can probably go on the sideboard. Really? Yeah, like, if someone's going to steal our stuff, it's cool. But, like, otherwise, it's just a... It gives your whole team plus one plus one. Wow, my whole team? Yeah. Oh, wow. The whole squad. That's super cool. The whole squiddle. Adorned Pouncer? I don't even know what that shit. I don't even know what that is. Don't try to don't try to flex on me. Remember, you can only get green stuff. Of course our crew fix. Meh. Yeah. Remember Death Mist Raptor? Remember how annoying that guy was? He was the big thing for a long time. He was a big thing for a long time. I don't even know why we talk, man. <laughs> well, you talk and then I'll just repeat you. He was a big thing for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like Jade Light uh... Ranger. Not a big fan of planeswalkers just because we have no real what way. What about to... that the guy on the last page, the little alpha man? Loxodon Smiter? Mm -hmm. That's pretty boring. It's a 4 4. Yeah, but it's not a creature I want to sacrifice or sacrifice into. Well, with that attitude. What about what about that attitude? I'm just saying with that attitude. Murderous Rider also seems good here. Oh yeah, that's an obvious thing. Because you can play it, and then you can sacrifice it after you play it. This is 34, so we're like running out of slots here. But I also think we're doing okay. Like a rock. Oh, like a rock. Yo, you hini. You like when stuff dies. I think I hear Laurel. Laurel. <laughs> yeah, hini. Laurel. Laurel. Yeah, hini. <laughs> what do you hear, Laurel or Yahini? I don't remember. Well, you can hear it right now. It's I'm literally doing no, it. No, that's not Laurel. how that works. Yeah, Heaney. Which one do you hear? I heard both, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> what about Charming Prince? Sure. Charming Prince actually seems amazing because it blinks your creatures. So, like, you can play it, you can blink your Siege Rhino, and then you can charm, you can actually Eldritch Evolution it away. Okay, man. Don't go nuts. You don't like that? No, I do. Well, then why are you being a little bitch about it? Why are you being a little shit? 
Why'd you put, don't put that in the sideboard, man. We have 34 cards. So? We need some cuts, my dude. Why would you cut that first? Because we still have three, and we have tons of things that... Going, Being able to sacrifice, like, Charming Prince... Oh, this deck seems sweet. This deck seems sweet so far. I'm, like, getting excited now. So I wouldn't start shaving numbers till we're all set with all this stuff. Here, okay? It's back in the deck, okay? Thank you. Crying out loud. I appreciate it. I also want a third Charming Prince, because it's, like, so good. It, it does everything we want it to do. Sure. But now we have 20, 30... Like, now we have no more slots, so... You can still adjust. Why don't you adjust? Why don't you shut up? Why don't you, uh, shut up? Do you think that's why your mom gave you away? Because she didn't... Because she didn't like you? My mommy gave me away. Then my dad walked away. That's a rough combination, man. There was no one left. Because my mom walked away. She dead. Is there any cool seven drops? Let's finally look at seven. We're also only looking at rares and mythics. We haven't even looked at like uncommons, so there could be really good uncommons and commons to play. But, no, no trash. But oh, Hornet Queen. What about one Hornet Queen up in this piece? That seems okay. Also, you can blink it with Charming Prince. Going, and we also sacrifice the Queen herself to get the end raise forerunners. That's a pretty good combo. That seems legit. And put one on the sideboard now. I'm sorry. Like it just we have so many things that do similar things. This guy, this guy. What does Tolmergerbaderp do? Makes a three three and it comes into play. Whenever a wolf enters the battlefield under your control, you gain three life and the wolf fights something. Okay. So it's basically a kill card. Kill card. Kill shot. <clears throat> okay. Overgrown. Where? There we go. Four. Temple. I just don't know why I'd, I don't know why I'd live my life like this. I wonder if garden is easier. It is. Wow. I always pick the wrong word. Next land. Godless. That's got to be the good word. What's the good word? Godless is my favorite word. We're definitely heaviest green. Right. Um. What's the other one? What's the green white one? Razor Verge. Hmm. I thought it was Razor. Oh, it is, but it's not legal because it was not in. It's like in Scars of Mirrodin. Oh. Yep, that makes sense. Um, so basic land. My daddy. Did you know Vivian Arcbow Ranger is seventy tickets in Magic Online? What the hell is that? Exactly. But now I want to know. Can you show me? I want to know. Can you show me? Sun Petal. I actually like Sun Petal better than like Blooming Marsh, to be quite honest. I'm going to put three of these guys in. Take a Blooming Marsh out and then add. Isolated Chappie. Woodland. Cemetario. I think this seems okay. I kind of like this. I think this deck looks good. I like being able to go Green Warden. Like, you, you sack a Siege Rhino or, like, a Fine Broker into a Green Warden. You get back Elder's Evolution. Yeah. And then you can sack the Green Warden to get Elder's Evolution back again and to get Hornet Queen. And then you sack the Hornet Queen to get End Race Foreigners. That's pretty cool. Is there anything? Might be able to just cut one of these and put the other one on the board. Sure. Like we only need one to search for, right? Yeah. Sure, like, sure. we we'll play another murder shredder. No, I was there was another card that I wanted to add, wasn't there? Not that I recall, but we also have no ramp. Like, sorry to burst your bubble, but Elders Evolution exiles itself. It does. Well, shit. That's worse, but that's fine. That's fine. We don't need to do that. We don't need to do the crazy shenanigans. We can just live our lives like that. That is a real disappointment, I'm going to be honest with you. It makes me just not want to play this deck. Really? Yeah. 
Because hmm. now we have to cut all the things that bring stuff back because they're not that good. No, I don't. If you go Eldritch Evolution, sack a Siege Rhino to get a, a Green Warden to get back a Siege Rhino. I that's still so. pretty good. Like, there's a lot of value in the deck, and I think that's really the important part. The important part is the value and the friends we made along the way. You know what I mean? No, I hate that. <laughs> Jesus. I might just want a 25th land. Yeah. Maybe another Jade Light Ranger to hit lands. Uh. Okay, you said Rishkar's expertise twice. What does that do? That's not going to be. Rishkar. Hogar. Let's do that. Draw cards are the greatest power. You may cast a card. I don't hate Rishkar's expertise. I think it's actually a pretty sweet card. It's really dependent on your board, though. Oh, uh, we're not playing blue. We just this defaulted to, to black because Siege Rhino, basically. It's really what? Depending on what? Your board. Like, they can kill a big guy in response and it's really bad. Well, then you get to draw, like, three cards instead, maybe. Why well, no one mana critters? I don't know. Like, I just don't think the ones we have available in Pioneer are great. There's no Birds of Paradise. There's no Noble Hierarch. So, you're stuck with either... Uh, land or Elves. Or Gilded Goose, and neither of which, like really are great. Like, I don't want to go turn one Llanowar off into turn two Eldritch Evolution and get, like, a three drop. My daddy gave me a name. Varels could be decent. Interesting. What does he do again? Varels. That's not how you spell it at all. I'm looking for an R there, I think, Chief. Varels is each creature card in your graveyard has scavenged. The scavenged cost equal to his mana cost. And then you can sack another creature and regenerate him. So, like, he's basically just gives all your creatures, like... Uh, yeah. All right, we'll oh, play one fine. Varels. How about that? Sure. My daddy gave me a name. What was it? Shitbird? No, Steven. Your dad gave you the name Steven? Yeah. But you called Michael? Yeah. It's fascinating. Wow, where are my goat bots at? The goat bots is like we're out. We're out. We can't. We can't keep up. That's weird. Where my, where are my goat bots at? Hmm. Do I just got a card. Do I just got a card bot? This feels weird. I'm not used to going to different bots. I'm really out of my my comfort zone here. The goats here. are all busy. They're not online. Huh. Huh. Let's look up Charming. If this dude's more than a ticket, I'm going to be real surprised. 27 cents. Well, it's technically not more than a ticket. How about Tulsimir? That dude's the friend of wolves. Six cents? Deal. I'll take two, just in case. Endraise Forerunners. That guy's going to be nothing. That guy's going to be like 0. .005 $100. cents. $100? Or either 5 cents or $100. It's point six cents. I feel like this moto price is either like under a dollar or over like 20 for some or reason. Or over 20. I hate you. I hate you. I don't know why I'm here. Fuck, I ask myself that every day. I'm going to get four Charming Princes. I'm going to just add another Charming Prince to the deck. I think having four Charming Princes is a good place to be. Um... Anything else between questing beast? Like that guy's gonna be like. See where it goes. We need. Well, we need to have an extra slot, don't we? No. What did we add? We added. The, oh, the varals. Yeah. The yeah. Varals. All right. I'll take three then. Three. It is my good man. Well, we can't. I don't think we have room for one spot of time anymore. Like we just have sixty cards here. Plus, we're not looking for any creature in, in. Like this is our way to get creatures, not one spot of time. I don't be casting dudes. Questing beast. What are you going? What are you going for? Like. Six. It's not terrible, but I'm also not gonna pay it. I ain't paying for shit. My daddy gave me a name. What about our sideboard? What else do we want? Put for some that? thought seasons in the sideboard. Probably a good idea. They're probably just following the main, but whatever. That would take too much time. I don't to have room out. in the main, man. You want to borrow one? Want to borrow one from 
from Mana Traders. ManaTraders.com, which is a great subscription service that you can get 20% off with for the first three months of any subscription if you use the link and promo code in the description. In the prescription bump. In the prescription bump? Yeah. Hmm. That's crazy, man. Yeah, man. Mike salt out. What does that mean? I can go anywhere. Do I have any Vivians? God, I wish I did. I would sell every last one of them. My virals gave me a name. What was it? Richard. Richard. <laughs> Jesus. Yikes. No. Dang. Why Six. Is that so many tickets. Because of the counters deck, it puts two one one. It puts a one one counter up to two creatures. It puts two counters distributed any way you want. So, okay. Uh, distribute two one one counters up to two target creatures that gain trample. So, like with the hardened scales, you're just like two 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 two, two 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 two. Uh, two, two, you thought the problem was Frank Cutie Pie? It is. Two, 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 two. It is. All right, this looks good. What do we add to the sideboard? What does this meta game even look like right now? Who knows? Well, I'm gonna find out. That's all now. It's like completely random. It's a lot of mono green. It's good against mono green. I don't know, things that destroy Eugene's. Eugene's? Oh, this mono green deck is a tokens deck, my dude. Hmm. Maybe damnation. I want to put two damnations damnation in this. Damnation legal? No, probably not. I want to languish. All right, that'll do. All right. <laughs> Actually, is all that right. even gonna be good enough? Yeah, that should be good enough. It doesn't kill one there, one of Pelucronos. Yeah, all right, we'll try that. <laughs> yeah, it kills most stuff in the format, I think. Kaya's Wrath actually might work. Let's do Kaya's Wrath. Yeah, I like that. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. Ritual of Sit. No, you want to kill four drops. Thought not Seers, Virgil's Gear Hulks, things like that. Two more cards in the sideboard. What are they going to be? Some against graveyards. I don't know if there's that much graveyard stuff here. I don't either. I was just giving a random suggestion. Okay, I was just telling you. Thank you. Okay, I don't need your attitude, all right? Valtrex, Pummel Grind, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Oh, yeah, these decks are looking fierce, boy. Oh, Noxious. It seems good. Yeah, Noxious. Oh, that card? Yeah, yeah. that card's good. Alright, that'll be our that'll be our deck right now. Let's chip it out and chip it in. What does that mean? You chip it out, then you chip it in. I fucking think you're drunk, dude. Why don't you go get some of that scotch? Get some get, pour yourself a nice glass of log of wool and It's almost out though, man. What does that mean? It's gonna go away. So you're just gonna save it? So you're literally doing with the log of wool and the thing I do with ammunition and money in games. You're never gonna. You want to well, save also, I didn't it so you don't finish it off because I, I feel like you deserve more of it. I don't even drink. That's true. I might as well finish it. You can just get me more. Also, for, to be fair, get me more for Christmas, man. Also, to be fair, I don't think you really want that for Christmas, but uh, <laughs> they say after it's under half a bottle, it'll slowly start to evaporate anyway. So you should probably you drink it. You fucking idiot! You're just wasting it, man. You know you're right. I'm gonna go pour myself a glass. Wow! Make sure it's real tall, boy. I don't think there's that much left, so... Well, I've missed. Just bring the whole bottle in here, then. Ooh, I'm drinking out of a bottle like a savage? It's not a savage. That's baller status.
I'll keep this hand. We don't have a white source, but we'll get one. Are you ready? And he walked away. Mike's daddy gave him away. man talk about let's talk about luck does it need someone to care about you don't let it slip away our opponent's like oh what do i do what do i do about this sure you got it let me discard two of my phoenixes you got it my dude what about love? Don't you want someone to care about you? They didn't discard any phoenixes whatsoever. That was aggressive. I don't necessarily approve of that. I'm gonna have a rhinoceros come down next turn. Oh, here he comes, boy. Hello, my name is Michael, and I have a little beverage. Oh, look, he's got his little. He didn't drink out of the bottle. He's stupid. You stupid dummy. Like Someone said, science says the liquid does not care about how much volume is left in terms of evaporation principles. Got him. That's just what I heard on the internet, so maybe it's wrong, I don't know. You literally believe everything you read on the internet? Well, it was from fancy whiskey guys. I don't know, man. Oh. They could be wrong. I'm not saying it's the ultimate knowledge. Yeah, you're right. Because it ain't. What about love, Michael? Don't let it slip away. What about love, Michael? Don't you need someone to care about you? Yeah, that's what I thought. Look how dead they are. Our opponent? Why, because we just have one siege rhino? Yeah. Well, they did just treasure cruise, so that's a thing. Draw all the cards you want. You're going to be dead, idiot. <laughs> Jesus, that's aggressive. You're going to be dead, idiot. Hair today, Gonti tomorrow. <laughs> what up, blessed checker? Discard a land? Yeah, that seems great. Let's do that. So I'll play you. Discard. Green. Seems good. Get him. Get him. Get, 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 get him. They're going to double anger here. Is it charm? Sure. Collective Defiance and Anger to get rid of Gonti and the other one. See, they're dead. Yeah, make sure you wear glasses while you drink your scotch. How is it? Smoke. <laughs> Say again? <laughs> <It's> <laughs> smoking. <laughs> Sorry, I don't uh I don't drink the spirits very often. 
I'm not used to it again. Smoke it, <laughs> I hate that Green Warden can only get back a forest right now, even though we've had Cedrano Gonti and Voice of Resurgence in play. I mean, it is pretty smooth for whiskey, but at the end of the day, it's still whiskey, so it still burns your throat a little bit. Whiskey, it'll burn your throat. Oh, they're charting a course. What time are you going to be home tonight, man? <laughs> pretty late, probably. God, I'm tempted to play some Jedi. Man. I'll just play the first two hours. You watch the replay, and then you can just... Oh, what's the scotch? This is Lagavulin. Thank you. Unseen Spectre, thank you so much for the resub. Really appreciate it. You are awesome, my dude. It's very peaty and smoky. The old Ron Swanson drink. Okay, I get you're drawing a lot of cards. I get that, but Lagavulin's good. Uh, it can be a little pricey, but <laughs> Jesus Christ! Woo! <laughs> and he really is a sunny deal whiskey. <laughs> like I'm just playing. Oh, it's so spicy. <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. That's amazing, dude. Man, you're going to make me show up to my drunks at my poker game when I'm going to go all in on hand one and lose. Yeah, and then we can come back and play Jedi, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Fallen orders. <laughs> yeah, and I get arrested for a DUI. So yeah, don't do that. Right. Jesus, Michael. I wanted to go to the finish line, too. The finish line? Yeah, I want to see that? if they got any Yeezys. Oh, you want to do that tonight? Well, I probably can't do that. I mean, I just got to go to walk in and walk out. It's taking me like 10 minutes. You mean like on the way for food? Yeah. Well, what time is it now? It's only like 5.38 okay. right now. Well, I just don't know how long we're going to stream, so that... Forever. We'll, we'll stream forever. We'll probably done stream at like 7. Okay. And then I'll probably come back and do more. Maybe. We'll see. I don't know. It's a late short day. Whatever. We're having fun yeah, now. It's hard to tell. Um, like the poker game could end at like one, but it could also end at like three. Yeah. So it's really hard to tell. Could end at five. Could end tomorrow at nine a.m. That's not no. That the, the blinds are too. What if it never ends? That. The blinds are too aggressive, man. Eventually, it'll just be we all have one big blind. <laughs> That's it. This is the game that never ends. Mike just goes on and on my for. Wow, they drew more cards. And I'm on, I'm on a pretty hot winning streak at poker night. I've won like the last five games in a row or something. Get like a little Dr. Humble might, brags over here. Four. It might have been four, but. Are they just dead? Like they've done nothing this game except for draw cards. Wow. All right. That I mean, was... it hates to be mean, but honestly, the field is pretty soft, uh, as they would say. Right now? Oh, at your poker game. Yeah. I was like, uh, the, the Pioneer field? I'm like, what are you talking about? All you got to do is play super straightforward. Never bluff. It doesn't work. They always call. Play ABC poker. That's all you gotta do. ABC. My gun is one, two, three. There's actually one player that's good, but as long as I can deal with him, it's fine. Something, something. Mike B, can you explain how the blinds work and hold them? Uh, sure, yeah. So the blinds, uh, what it does is in your game, say you're playing five people, two people have to post a little blind and a big blind. The little blind is half of the big blind. Oh, so it goes dealer, little blind, big blind. Yes. And the reason for the big blinds, and those are set uh, something amount like, let's say, $1 and $2. Those are your blinds. $1 is small blind, $2, two is the big blind. So the reason why the, that happens in poker is to make sure there's action in the hand. So every hand, you can win some chips no matter what happens. So someone's going to at least win a little blind and a big blind no matter what. And then uh, and when you're playing like tournament style, they go up every certain... Where I play, we do it every 20 minutes, the blinds go up. And they get bigger and bigger and bigger. That way it keeps forcing the action forward and, and closing the game out. Right. It's just a way to, to encourage, like, to to ensure that people are actually betting and losing some amount of money per, per hand. Mike B, so you play with Ante, or better yet, an Ante? Uh, we do not play an Ante. Ante is something like a big blind where everyone has to put in a certain amount. We just play with big blind, little blind, and those keep going up. What if your Ante wanted to play? What if she was like, Michael, I'd like to play poker with you and your friends tonight. Can you Ante play tonight? I'll what? take your $10. <laughs> God damn. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Scotch. 
How is it? Smoking. <laughs> 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 Scotch. <laughs> I didn't expect the like long. How is it? I put on the glass and I wait for a while and I'm like, smoking. <laughs> That clip is much better than I thought it was. Oh, holy shit. Wow, that is... <laughs> Smoky. <laughs> God damn. I believe seven card stud has an ante. Um, no, you can use antes and hold them to you to, to force more action. Most tournaments have a big blind, a little blind, and then after a certain amount of levels, there's also an ante. So everyone has to put an ante, plus you have your little blind and your big blind. Ante is usually smaller than a big blind or a little blind. I guess I should have took reunion. No, they have the antis also make the game quicker and the pots bigger. Smoking. I think the best part of clip worthy moments is you watching your clip. Watch the clip. Yeah, it's pretty good. Antis are a little more straightforward. The thing I like about the big blind and little blind is it helps uh, people remember their position in the hand a little bit. Man, our hand is in the nuts. It's fucking terrible, dude. So you kept five lanes, Fotsies? Yeah, because I didn't want to go to five cards. Okay. <gasps> Look, we drew another fucking land. This is amazing. Are you getting drunk already? No, it's just a hiccup, man. It happens when you Are you shit-faced? Not yet, but I will be. God damn. We did win game one, yeah. He must be drinking too. <laughs> oh crap, I gotta do laundry. Let me get, I gotta get that started. Don't leave it in there though, because I gotta do laundry tonight too. Okay, I will. How is it? Smoking. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. They got a, one anger and another mountain, I guess. Alright. Smoking. Sphinx's tutelage. Oh boy. Oh, that's good to know. Alright, I'm tapping this all wrong. Green, white. There we go. I don't think we can beat this. Wait, they're probably going to mill themselves, aren't they? Oh, it's target opponent. Huh. Thing in the ice, thing in the ice. That's a lot of cards that you just milled, yeah. I'm gonna concede. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So what they drew? They draw. Oh, they they redrew their hand. Oh, yeah. All right. So I was coughing in the other room while I was gathering my laundry. Yeah, because it was smoky. <laughs> and Felipe literally comes out of his room. He's like, hey, dude, are you all right? <laughs> so I was coughing so much. Well, you know what they say. Get him. Huh. What is this like? What is this little thing on the bottom here? Man, when Elk Deer sees that clip, he's going to be disappointed to me. Oh! Get him. Look at those fighting. Them's fighting wolves. Oh, is he trying to mill you out?
Yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, bitch. Get him. I'm gonna get him. Okay. Why don't you drink your lager and I am. chug it? Chug, 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 chug. Come on. I'm trying to enjoy it, man. I'm trying to get you to chug it. That makes sense. I can see this definitely being a saffron olive deck. As long as we don't die. This deck is cool. There's definitely probably a more optimal build for it, but it's hard to on the fly. Are you talking about us? Yeah. What's wrong with it? We got a lot of one ofs, which is is usually so? kind of a bad thing. Oh, is it? Wow. I guess with the resolution, it's not that bad. It's fine. Oh God, see that stupid thing do. They get to draw three and mill us three. We're eighteen cards. Oh, they're gonna go here. Treasure cruise. Opt, huh? You conceding? Yeah, we're not gonna win this. Really? Yes. Well, how, I'm gonna bring in Knights of Autumn. Pow, 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 pow. Pow, 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 pow. Take out Varals. Take out Murderous Riders. Bring in another. Oh, Murderous kills the wall. Not the wall. I mean, flips is a pretty big problem. Bring in these abrupt decay. So does so does abrupt decay. <coughs> abrupt decay kills that bitch wall too. Mike, who plays Commander almost exclusively, thinks a deck full of one of is bad. Well, there's different <laughs> formats, man. You gotta have different formats, different opinions about different formats. God, you're so drunk right now, it's unbelievable. I'm, I'm about to be. I'm, I'm about to be. Got that dragon breath. You need two cuts here. What could they be? Uh, Hornet Queen might be just too slow. I can, I can get behind that. And eh, Blood Baron doesn't do much here. Sure. Done. My daddy gave me away. He gave you away? Yeah. This hand seems great. Yeah, I agree. Put the pressure on, assuming we hit a fourth land drop. I mean, kill their stupid thing in the ice. And go voice. He's really drunk right now. He's Get saying, a three drop. He's saying he's not, but he is. Kill their wall. Seed run out of their face. Dead. <laughs> See? See what? I don't know. <laughs> Say what? I just wanted to say that after the draw. Well, if, if it was really good, it would have been awesome, but it wasn't. Mike's daddy gave him a name, and then he walked away. <coughs> oh, look at this! I got a little, I got a little thing in the icicles. All right, well, fingers Thing crossed. We need to land, and we need them to not have anger. Those are the two things that need to happen. Oh, well, that guy's not getting in there, I guess. There was really no point in doing that, so. I just wanted to do it. No anger of the gods? Fourth land. No anger? Fourth land. No anger? Fourth land. No anger? Sounds good. Deal. Questing beast. Questing, Questing beast. beast. Yeah, the best draw here would be like a forest. Scotch. Oh. How is it? Smoke. <laughs> <laughs> the way Scotch. I said it was so weird and natural. Smoke. Land. Oh my god, we it did everything forest. we needed to do. Told you. Did you? Get him with the nutter ball. The nutter ball? Yeah. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I mean, I am worried about it, Michael. I am worried about it. Oof. Are you okay? What are you doing? Oh, the shirt's a little hot. <laughs> Why don't you roll your sleeves up? I got, through, I got the fan on and the window open. And what's the temperature outside? Let me do this. 63? 66 degrees outside. I hope you don't have anger. Yeah, anger would be pretty gross here. Oh, I mean, we're not super dead, but... Ugh. We're not dead at all, but it is annoying. Yeah, we get two guys. It's not that bad. No, we don't, because anger exiles them. Oh, right. Yeah, that would be sick, though. <clears throat> oh, that's not anger. Oh, and it's turn four, so you can't go land anger, either. Oh, you're dead. Still got a lot left, man. You're really slow. You're really, 
You're like nursing you this that thing, stuff, man. Okay. What? Have you ever drink that stuff? Okay. Have you ever drink that stuff? Okay. Yeah. Have you ever drink that stuff? Okay. I don't know where the okay fits in there. Have you have you ever drink that stuff? Okay. I know you have, so you know it's a it's a <laughs> sipping drink. It doesn't fit. It's a sipper dipper. A sipper dipper. Yeah. Buddy, you are so hammered right now. It is not even funny. Do we rhino or do we bash him? No, we bash him. I guess that just does more damage. Four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. This is twelve damage. No, ten damage. Still a lot. Thank you. They're almost in rhino range. <clears throat> Krasuskiman, thanks so much. They say that all men are created equal, but you look at me, and you look at Frank, and you can see that statement is not true. That's true. You are far more generous and supportive than I am, my friend. We are not equal at all. You are my. So what can they even have here? They could nothing. They concede. They'd have to go double anger, and they can't because they only have five lands. They can go single anger to get rid of these guys, and then this guy lives. That ain't gonna do it. It's Wednesday, okay? <clears throat> Fire cosm legal? <clears throat> no, I think so, right? I mean, yeah, it's probably legal, but who cares? They ain't got two power clasms. They could, though. Also, we would just actually that would just kill them anyway because we get our guys back. No, wait, no, it wouldn't. Never mind. That'd actually be really good. What are you saying right now? Pyroclasm also would would put two guys on the board. Yes, but then the second one would kill those two because they kill two everything. Would, yeah. But then we just siege around them, put them to one. Whatever. Yeah. It is Wednesday. <clears throat> My dudes. Oh, one shock. One beer. Oh, now they're going to... Oh, one shock, one anger does it. Oh, that's not what you had, though. Now what? Still dead. Okay. Okay, my dude. <clears throat> Was there anything we didn't like there? Or we just want to run it back real quick so we can play Pad B? Okay, we'll run it back real quick. I mean, we didn't... Nothing seemed terrible. You seem terrible. That's hurtful, man. Deal with it. I'm gonna close this out. We'll leave the event. Okay. I just wanted to close it to make sure the uh, <clears throat> the size is retained. I might want another white land here. I might want to take a one forest out, put like a sun petal grove in. We actually have three sun petal groves. Why not four? I don't know, man. How many white sources? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. How many black sources? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Green sources? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I think it's fine. I can see Isolated Chapel. How is it? Smoky? Yeah, smoky. Smoky. <clears throat> also drinking on the empty stomach, so it'll hit me harder. Log of the fool and it'll burn your throat. That's because Michael doesn't eat meals until 8 p.m. It's basically true. Oh, uh, this hand seems just fine. Keep it and sneep it and Michael beep it. If anyone wants to donate Jedi Fallen Order to the stream, me and Michael will be streaming that thing. I haven't picked it up yet. I still have to. So this meatball and mayo stiff happening at 8 p.m.? Uh, no. 8 p.m.? Wow, that's, uh... Wow. Are we... you, can't, you can't buy any more, man. I know. No, you're right. I actually have no literal... Because you still have two more coming. 
you just like there's literally like you're gonna have to start displaying them in, in the living room, room or something. <laughs> it's not good. I don't know how you're gonna do. I'll that. just cycle through them. Oh shit, we're doing graveyard shenanigans. We'll just cycle through them. You like sell some and then put the others up. No, I'll, like put some away and then I'll. <clears throat> Where are you going to fit those, oh, man? Oh, dude, I got this notice for a class action settlement against Zappos. You know what Zappos is? It sounds familiar. The shoe, it's like an online shoe retailer. Okay. Zappos.com. And, like, they're like, if you want to apply for this class action settlement, toward the Fallen Order, Josh, the, the Fallen Order Fund, you are awesome, my dude. I really appreciate you. Thanks, buddy. Thank you, Josh. That is freaking awesome, dude. And like the, here's the here's the reward the the uh, the payout if you if you apply for this class action settlement, because you were a customer of Zappos in 2012, you are entitled to receive a 10 percent discount on your next Zappos purchase. It's a class action settlement where your reward is being able to buy more shoes. That seems pretty bad. It's fucking terrible. <clears throat> It's just unreal. It's, it's unreal insulting. It's like if you have a, a bad experience at a place and they give you a discount that is not even greater than their profit margin. So they're literally just like, eh, well, you had a shitty meal. Here's 5% off your next meal. And you're like, right. so you're literally giving me the gift of being able to come back? That's so weird. I'm just like, wow. Congratulations on giving me a, a refund of paying for another meal. We wanted to reach out again to remind you that you may use your discount code between now and the end of the year. Oh, and it's timed. Nice. December 31st, 2019, 11.59 p.m. Pacific. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I was just like, uh, what? Uh, but? Uh, what? Do I even, like... I think I just have to play Tumble Garden here and pass. Like tapped. We take five. <clears throat> I mean, I guess we could abrupt decay this. It doesn't feel great though. All right, whatever. I had a restaurant give me a free dessert on my next visit after a bad experience. Yeah, I'm like, can you give it to me this visit? <laughs> like having a bad visit and insisting that the person comes back is is just actually. It's, weird. Yeah. it's just the most audacious thing you can do, I think. I never went back, yeah. Like, why would you go back? Yeah, we're up to king this guy. Otherwise, there's no point in putting this dude in a play tapped. Are you drunk still? Still. Boy. I was born drunk. You were born drunk? Yeah. Maybe that's why your dad left. You know, the more things you tell me, the more it makes sense. I'm like, oh, yeah, I get it. But it's also my dad's fault because he hadn't left. I'd probably be a standard, upstanding human being. What's your dad's name? Ron. Byron? Wow, Ron. that's funny because I was going to say Byron, and Byron actually has Ron in it, which is actually kind of interesting. Well, I've literally told you the name before, but I don't yeah. expect you to remember it. Yeah, I remember your dad saying, Hey, you remember your dad, Ron? Ronald? Ronnie? Ron or Ronald McDonald? Oh, your dad's named after Ronald McDonald? That's weird. I don't think that's how that works. Probably is, though. Ooh, do I want a trophy? I don't think so. <laughs> b Ron, like K-Rick. <laughs> what is that from? Is that a meme? Are you you're fucking totally shit faced right now? This is amazing. I'm not shit faced, but I am a little tipsy. <laughs> Take another swig, Michael. I will in a second. Michael, swig it up. Swiggy swooty, get that booty. <laughs> Why do you say the things that you say? Because it's fun to say. Did you actually get that booty? Try Oban 14 year. World's better than Logable and interesting. Yeah, I'm not super experienced with whiskeys. The only whiskeys I've really had is Lagavulin. Uh, I've had <clears throat> like uh, Crown Royal, and I've had like one other type. That's about it. I think I want a Siege not Rhino smoky. here. Okay. I feel good about a Siege Rhino. Ooh, you really? 
Park. should get some Highland Park. What is that like Lingham Park? Three, four, five, yeah. six. Do, 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 do. I'm just gonna cast this dude. I feel like if we can survive one more turn and play Blood Baron, I think we could we could really turn the corner, as Marshall Sutcliffe would say. Scotch is quite an entire acquired taste. Yeah, <clears throat> most alcohols are. Or spirits, or whatever you want to call them. Like, how's your talking working, man? <clears throat> I'm working on it. Highland Park is a fantastic mid-range scotch. You can get it for usually around fifty bucks. That's pretty decent price. For Close whiskey. for a second. I'll open Steam so I can pick up Fallen Order. Oh, I've also had uh, Jack, obviously. You ain't had Jack, Michael. Wow. Did I say? Because you said I've had Jack, and I said you haven't had. Yeah, Jack. I got it, buddy. Okay, take it easy. He's gonna grapple with the past. Okay. Well, someone has to. If your name is Mike B, and your dad left you, yeah, fall in order. Purchase for myself. I hope there's no sales tax. God, there's no. I purchased for myself. That's not my dad. That's a cell phone. You know what that's from? Yes. Be? Some Lonely Island. Sounds lonely. How did the glass pie... How, how's the glass pie diet going, Jim? I don't know anything. I don't have no idea what any of that means. That was the most random sentence I think I've heard today. Yeah, that's a weird thing. You're, that's, a, that's something right there. That's a something. I want to play this gentleman. It's alright to tell me. Blood Baron of Viscopa. <laughs> I was trying to play a cube deck against a modern deck. Well, you see. Challenges. Ch -ch 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 challenges. Turn and face the strange ch -ch challenges. How do they beat a Blood Baron? Uh, so let's see. You're going to block. I block this guy. guy. I take one, ten. two, three, four, five. I go to one, and then I gain four, so I got five. I take one. Okay. Fascinating. Is this the card I want to use? Probably. Got an 09? Th yeah, yeah, that'll do. All right. Turn and face the strange ch changes. Install. Thank you for your Steam purchase. Josh, appreciate it, buddy. done I'll install that while you're at your little pokey game your little hokey I don't think I'll take that long maybe you don't <clears throat> lifelink is is a is a hell of a drug it's pretty good oh. being against if you want to lose life you don't tap oh we're oh, dead, we're dead. <laughs> oh I see well then super ultra mega dead Remember the time we were like, how do they deal with this? We figured it out. Funny thing is, I haven't bought it for myself yet. Well, you know what they say. A ticket for two is worth five in the hen. In the hen? Yeah. Smoking! You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Smoking. During Shadow Rip, really had a Divinity of Pride and a Boon Reflection. Yeah, that sounds not... <coughs> Shut up, Michael. No. No! I'm not gonna do it! Take Fat Pig out. Oh, we got an extra slot? Dang. I know. We do want something for graveyards, I think. I'll snap it off. Snap it off on the snap in keeper. Snap it off on the snap in keeper. Yeah. You got a problem with that? I don't. That's what I thought. What did you do? You just pull your shirt? Yeah. How's that working out for you? Fine. I don't even know who that character is. Domino? She was literally in Deadpool 2. 
Oh, the luck, the luck lady. Yes. Okay. Also, the statue is insanely amazing looking. I guess she does have the same spot in her eye. She's on this like. But I also slot like machine. the only thing I know her from is that movie, so I expect her to look different, like from the movie. You know what I mean? So I didn't expect it. Cool story, bro. I hate you. <clears throat> My type two deck, type two. Oh man. Uh, and that era was mono white with divinity of pride and light from within. Oh yeah, light from within is legit too. I don't know what that is. It's like the chromatic card. Um. Doesn't it give creatures plus one plus one for each white in their casting cost or something? Each creature you control gets plus one plus one for each white mana symbol and its mana cost. So Divinity of Pride would be like plus five plus five. Oh. Hmm. You know Divinity of Pride, right? Yeah. Because you play Commander? Yeah. It's a big fat 8-8. Eight, eight. You're right. Buddy, I know. I wasn't... Oh, look. Three lands. Yes. Excellent. Something, something. Mike side. Mike side? Mike side? Sounded like the washing machine threw up. It's like, Bleh. I think you're just prone to the throwing up noises now because you're drunk. You dribbled on yourself. I did? Yeah. Oh, God. How did you see that? I didn't even feel Caught it. out of the corner of my eye. This is the corner of my eye. Whoa. Oh, yeah. You like that? Too bad. I was watching a YouTube video from earlier this month, and Mike said Castle Garenbrig makes delicious glass pies. It was pr Oh. <laughs> Castle Garenbrig makes delicious <laughs> glass pies. <laughs> Oh god, that does make a lot more sense now. Yeah, all you had to, yeah, all you had to do was say that it was absolute nonsense that Mike has said before. I don't know why I include the Jimmy still, but cuz that's your thing. How's the glass pie die Gordon Jimmy? It's your little that's your thing, man. It's not always Jimmy, it could oh, be Jimmy. Reginald or You don't say Reginald. Sassafras. No, you've never said Sassafras. I just did, liar. Got him. Who did you get? You. No, I'm good. Oh, never mind then. Stupid. <laughs> Charming Prince. Can't believe I said that. Tiles of Garenbridge does make a delicious class, class pies. Garenbridge? What about it? Garenbrig? Is it Garenbrig? Yes, it's not Bridge. It's not Castle Garenbridge. We go over this every friggin' time. Yeah, too bad I don't care. Wow. Oh, Eldritch? That's the key card in our deck. It's like the Nutter Butter. Actually, have we we have yet to actually play that card, right? We have yet to draw that card, let alone play it. Mmm, Gazel Garenberg makes delicious glass pies. I wish I wish that was clipped. I bet somebody clipped it. <laughs> I bet we'll never find it, though. Oh, there's a Throne of the God Pharaoh. That's in the trash can. That's where I want it. What can we get with our... Oh, we can get, like, an Obsidat or a, another gentleman? Oh, yeah, we're leaving that thing on. We're just not blocking. Let's get in there with you. See what happens. I feel like our options are pretty good here. Sure. I don't care about your supplier. Even though you think I do. One, two, three. Eldritch evolution on this guy. What are we gonna get? Wow, look at this. That's amazing. Tulsimir. 
Uh, that seems good, gaining three. Obsidat seems pretty juicy. Find Broker to just get back something. Blood Baron seems real good here. I think it's Blood Baron. I do too, actually. I just think they can't really deal with it. <clears throat> yeah. You're right. Makes delicious glass pies, Jimmy. You might have even said Jimmy in the Ooh. quote. Are you okay? It's all gone. No, you still got a little bit in there, man. Okay, that doesn't really count. Look, there's a there's all a good it's amount water, in there, man. dude. It's water from the ice. It's yellow. Oh, God. Just chug it. Stop being a little baby. There you go. Michael, yeah, how did you get alcohol poisoning? Well, you see. You could chase it with water? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's important to drink water while you're drinking. Knuck if you buck. How come this guy doesn't have lifelink? Or vigilance, rather. I was like, well, he actually does have lifelink, so... Does he own a car? Tell me more, tell me more. It's either Chupacabra or Gonti here. I don't know which one, though. I think Chup. What does Chup do? Kill their 3-3? Yeah. Can they get it back? I don't know. Who cares? Who's to say? You can play Gonti. You're only 14. You say that now. Let's attack with this Blood Baron. Can't block, can't block, can't block, can't block. They gotta either block with Narcomu or Sitter Wayfinder if they want to. I am your Obza Dad. Got him. You did. You did got him. No blocks, huh? The problem with Gonti is I just don't think there's anything we care about. The other cards are not that great, really. They're just trash. Come on, Eldritch Revolution into a 6-drop. I guess the only one we could actually hit now is Noxious Gear Hulk because the other two are in our hand. <sighs> the other two are in our hand. Two haunted dead in the graveyard, huh? Only one card in hand? Okay. Grapple. That's gonna be a grapple. You know what card would be decent in this matchup? One... S Spite Mare? Not Spite Mare. Um, Plague Mare? What'd it do? It's like the, the black 2-2 two, two for 3 that deals 1 damage to all other creatures when it comes into play. Is it other creatures or is it white creatures? I thought that was Murderous Girl. Murderous Girl. I thought you were talking about Murderous Girl. Massacre Girl? No, Michael, you had it. Murderous Girl. Massacre Lady? And you're... Murder Baby? Mike is two sheets to the wind right now. Murder Baby? Is that what you just said? I said Murder Baby. Myrtle Baby. Yeah. Not Myrtle. Murder. Myrtle? No, not Myrtle. Myrtle? No. Snurgles. Whatever, man. Murloc Baby? I don't even care anymore. You do. Never cared to begin with. Ooh. Genocide female. <laughs> That's correct. Massacre girl. Okay. I'm waiting for a good card, but you have none. Well, block with that narco amoeba if you want, like, knuck if you buck. Yeah, it would be nice if Gonti could get lands. I mean, he kind of did with Seder Wayfinder, right? Maybe. Depends on what you flip. Super aggro. Uh, biscuit if you trisk it. 
What do we take here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that's fine. I don't think they have any prized amount emerald glams in the graveyard. All right. Oof. Land would have been much better. Agreed. <clears throat> I wanna be your landy baby. I wanna be your man. Have you seen a creeping chill from the deck yet? No, we have not seen any creeping chills. Here we did. It's right here. Oh, I lied. Wow, unbelievable. You're a monster. You're basically history's greatest monster. So we can go block, block, block. We take one, two, three, four. And yeah, we can definitely get in there with this guy. Maybe this guy, too. No, then you just block with Stitchy Boy. Oh, Stitchy Boy. Yeah, Blood Baron's doing work for us. All right, well, let's see what we got here. Four, four on three, three, two, three on... Well, the Flyers aren't really... I and mean, we're gonna lose a bunch of dudes, I guess. Whatever. We get to untap, play OBS the dad. And then, oh, actually they might be dead. Attack for four and then OBS the dad to kill them. If they don't have a blocker. Oh, they're just crippling, chilling us. Now they're at nine. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Ooh, Woodland Bellower is legit here. Why? Because we can just go get, like, Knight of Autumn, gain four, get two blockers. It puts them to play? Yeah. That's pretty good. That's why I put it in here, man. Uh, yeah, that seems fine. Oh, we just won the game. That's All right, cool. still, still, uh, still possible to win this bad boy. Did you just hit your hand? Maybe. What's wrong with you? I'm intoxicated. <laughs> oh, oh well, I see. How about Kaya's wrath? Kaya's wrath could be good here. Yeah, they're going pretty wide, so. Let's do it. Well, that's dead. Don't say you're not going to do it. I'm not going to say that. Why would I say that? Okay, calm down. No, you calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Don't tell me what I can't do. What's your graveyard hate? We, we just don't have any. Stone zero. I don't care about graveyards. Let them do what they want. You know what? I say do you care about grave graveyards, though? Grape yards? Yeah. Yeah, they're delicious. They went to six? Whew. You okay? Feeling it. Are you sweating? What if I tip you over a little oh, bit? Oh, don't do that. <laughs> Stop doing that. That's not a good time. Why? What's Which part of you is enjoying? Swishing around my blood. Swish <laughs> Swishing around my blood. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, God. Stop. Oh, it doesn't feel good. Oh, boy. That was a lost reference. That was a John Locke reference. Yeah, that was a pretty good. That was a pretty. Uh, Don't tell me what I can't do. 
It was pretty um ambitious poor I did. Ambitious poor is the name of my charity that I started for homeless people. It's not. You didn't do that. They're the ambitious poor, Michael. <laughs> It's a charity for the ambitious poor. No, I get it. I just no, I don't I think you did. I get it. I get it. No, <laughs> you poke your little belly. You like that, you little, you little drunky boy? I don't. I don't like that. <laughs> nope. Don't like that. No. Don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord. Bap. Are you making fun of the washing machine there? Yeah. <laughs> Bap. Did I detect a niner? Were you dialing from a walkie-talkie? No, were you, though? Were you dialing from a walkie-talkie? Like, legit question, have you lost weight? You look a little thinner. I mean, it may have. I don't know. I haven't really weighed myself in a while. I haven't weighed since the last time I went to a doctor. Which was, like, a month and a half ago. Man, when you get an update on that sleep apnea machine that you don't use? <laughs> I'm listening. Are you just gonna not use it? You're like, thanks for the machine. I'll never use it because I'm too lazy. Well, or... It was free. Oh, if it was free, then never mind. <laughs> who who wants to? I mean, like, if you're improving the quality of your life for for no cost, then who cares if it works or not, right? I just I, I can't sleep with it. It just doesn't work. I mean, it works. I just can't do it. Yeah, because you're. Also, like, do this yeah. thing where I almost get to sleep, and then it'll feel like I can't breathe, which is funny, because considering, because of the but machine. Cons but considering. And then it'll wake me up. It'll wake you up? Yeah. Before you go-go? Oh, well, something like that. I don't think we need 25 lands in this deck, but it sure feels like it, doesn't it? We only playing twenty four. Yes, seems a little greedy for this deck to be honest. Does it? Yeah. Why? Look at your hand, man. I just need lands. One land gets me this. Two lands gets me these. Three lands gets me these. That's all lands to ask for. Oh, is it a lot of lands to ask for, Jimmy? Mike, on your suggestion, I listen to No Not November. How'd you like it, or did you like it? It's a funny What's song, but I think it's legitimately a good rap. It was pretty great. Have them adjust your pressure and your ramp. Yeah, it's almost like... If I've tried the delay on the ramp. It didn't help. Oh, well, then never mind. You've clearly done everything. I guess you're just the only human beaming in the world that's incapable of sleeping with them. What? I said human beaming. No, I didn't. You yeah, always think, think I say things think incorrectly, and then people check, and then it's not, it's not correct. Do people check? Well, I guess we're just done. Nah, Mike is right. Oh, dang. Is that true? Me and my good pals love a good bust. Wow. God, do I even want to block here? I can't take eight, so. All right, let's see. Only human beaming in the world that's incapable of sleeping with him. Only human beaming in the world that's inc I did say beaming. Dang got it. Got him. All right, you got me this time. Yeah, boy. I hope you're happy. I am. I'm delighted. These go on the tr on the stack at the same time, which is pretty bad because then they just take a million. Apparently, I have sleep apnea so bad my eyes open frequently during the night, but I refuse to see a doctor about it because Mike is right; those machines suck. God, I don't understand why you guys choose to live in like discomfort and like just being tired all day and like just not getting adequate rest. Well, I don't choose to. Like, I literally have tried the machine way over 10 times and I just cannot get used to it. I don't know, man. Like Most people say it only takes a week, but it, that's not my experience. I, I just can't sleep with it. I do want another green source in here. 
Maybe the isolated chapel can go for another woodland cemetery. I don't... I don't disagree that they're probably good for you and they make you feel better when you're done sleeping. I just, I'm 100% sure you would be a totally different person if I'm you I'm sure it would help me out, but, like, I can't get to sleep with it on. So, like, it just doesn't work for me. There's also some other stuff that you can use instead of a sleep apnea machine. So hopefully when I see the doctor in a couple weeks here, he'll be able to suggest the other things. And see what do you mean a couple weeks? When's your appointment, man? Well, I have an appointment with my psychiatrist on uh, the 3rd of December. And I'm probably going to follow up my s uh, schedule with my other doctor the week after. You haven't scheduled it yet? No, not yet. Why don't you just schedule it and go fix it now? Why are you waiting for like six weeks? Why though? <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. You could just be like, hey, what, can I come in this Tuesday and just make an appointment to see you to see if we can adjust the sleep apnea machine? Yeah, Why are you waiting that. six probably weeks to do that. that? What the fuck? I don't understand. Why? Like, it makes no sense to me. Your laziness literally decreases your quality of life. Your quality of life is worse because of the, the, the decisions you make, man. Drives I'm, me fucking insane. I don't disagree with you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I hate you. <laughs> I don't. Yeah, a lot of sleep is also a ritual and have agitation. It may take time to get adjusted. Well, like, most people say a week, two weeks, but, like, I, I've legit tried it, like, I can't, I don't know the exact number, but it's been, like, a lot of time. 40 times. Probably not that many. Probably, like, 39 I've times. I probably tried it about 15 times to try to sleep with it. Did you try, like, taking a Benadryl or something beforehand? Like, no. just to get, like, extra sleepy? Do Benadryls do that? Yeah, a lot of people take, like, Benadryl um, to, like, help them get to sleep. Like, if you're having trouble sleeping. Because it'll, like, knock you out. I didn't know out. that. Take melatonin. Don't don't not clean the machine, okay? Also, if you don't clean the machine, you can get a rare aspirin infection. Miss, miss, miss me with that. Well, I haven't used it enough for it to be cleaned yet, so. Miss me with that? What does that part mean? What's good graveyard hate in this format? My Relic dad. or Progenitus isn't legal, right? No. So what's legal? Uh, I don't know, man. I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's a good point. I can't argue with that. I'm trying to think of stuff. Scavenging use. Is the rest in peace legal? Yeah. Okay, that's a good one. That is a good one. All right, we'll put one scooze in the sideboard as a searchy boy. We'll take out these grasps. I don't think our deck suffers from rest Oh, somebody clipped it. Two people clipped it. Wow. Wow, why did they both come up right now? That's super weird. How did you guys both find this and clip and post it in the same exact minute? That's really weird. Hold on. This is a glass pot. Have you been to the Castle Garenberg? They have delicious glass pies. Oh, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I didn't say Jimmy. <laughs> have you been to the Castle Garenberg? Oh, Jesus God. This isn't a knock at all, but weight is a huge contributor to restlessness and oxygen deprivation during sleep. I used to not sleep well at all, and when I dropped 80 pounds, I found myself sleeping. Yeah, that's true too, but what they, uh, my doctor actually said that uh, sleeping with a sleep apnea machine, uh, because your brain's getting more oxygen, actually helps you lose weight. So it's a good, so basically you can sleep with it when you're overweight to help you lose weight. And yeah. And you lose enough weight, you don't need to use my it. My impression is that it literally jump starts so many functions of your body that are just like not working. Well, it's literally your brain just not getting enough oxygen during night. Which a is oxygen, you heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying, man, okay? It's hard. <laughs> That's what she said. You don't experience this. So you don't know. What, the oxygen? No, the drunkenness. Oh, <laughs> no, you're definitely you're definitely at a disadvantage for sure. Why did I do this? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I need some food. You want, a little, you, want some, you want some of these Sour Patch Kids? Yeah, I guess. I'll, well, that's not going to help. Just get out of here. You sure? It's not actual First food. they're sweet. They're sour. Then they're sweet. Let's not make them actual food. Whatever, Ron. 
Me and um, my friends. What do you think? Two rest in peace? Three rest in peace? Four we'll rest in peace? Phone. Wow. That would have been amazing. I was like, Ooh. Hey, man. Have you ever had any of those delicious cal glass pies at Castle Garenbrig? Of course. They're my favorite. That's the name of the clone spray where oxygen for men. <laughs> I always assume weight loss is impossible for me because I have a half a thyroid. Maybe it's also the sleeping thing. Um, isn't there like fixes for thyroid problems though? Isn't there like medicine you can take for that? Gra Graft Digger's Cage, Scoo's Rest in Peace, and Black Lightline. Okay. Yeah, don't take Benadryl for like like as a regular sleep aid. I'm just saying like if you're having a tough a, a, a tough time sleeping, then taking a, a Benadryl every like now like if it's a if it's not a regular issue, then it's a good it's way just to just the machine breathes for you, kind of. Yeah, you need like to it enhances it, and it's so it's just a weird sensation. Like it's really hard. to Like explain. a York peppermint patty, those let you get the sensation. Sensation, sensation. Yeah, sensation, that's what sensation. I meant, man. Did you just call me meant men? Maybe. Who knows? Oh, wow. Or we're playing against the... The cat the, daddy. The baker deck. The baker deck. Mm-hmm. Cat daddy, cat daddy, bake me a pie. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Graves disease? I don't even know what that is. What is that they just did? It flashed before my eyes. I have no idea. Breaking, they just milled themselves for eight. Man, these friggin' decks, dude. I guess we play voice here and hope we draw a third land again. Maybe we just need a 25th land in the deck. Take a fistful every time you want to nap. Dr. Frank in the house. Yeah, take a fistful of Benadryl every time. Please don't do that. Tell me a sad story. Pretty much had an absent father because he was tired. During my entire pre-adult years, he would sleep apnea and bad and checked out. Too tired all the time, he would go home from work and sit in front of the TV and doze off. That's me and Mike's entire friendship. You're really hitting home here. How dare you. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, you needed to hear it from me. I never fall asleep watching shows. Don't even say that. Sometimes I'll look over and be like... That has literally never happened. As I cannot... I literally cannot get to bed. Unless I'm in a bed. I can't get to bed unless I'm in a bed. Unless it's a very long couch. I like a girl on a long couch. I decided to pop a few Sudafade for work. Imagine my discontent when I realized it was three bed angels. Oh, God. That's not the same at all, dude. Cube is gone, Sammy. Oh, got to switch over the laundry. Wow, that was like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> oh, that was such a random like, oh, gotta go. Like something in your brain just like, just like popped. Oh boy. Are you okay? Are you wobbly? Oh geez. I don't. Oh god. He's gonna fall over, guys. Maybe. Oh boy. Oh, what about questing beast here? That seems good, right? Mm. Nothing they have can block this guy, so. Basically, immune system attacks your thyroid and sends your levels through the roof. I ate five meals a day, was starving all the time, and lost 30 plus pounds. Of None of that sounds healthy. Nope, don't like that. Gonna pet this dog. Oh god, he's so drunk right now. He's so fluffy and majestic. Is he? There's also a cat. Oh god. He's gonna pet that cat. <laughs> God, he's, he, he's having a good time. Yeah. Yeah. You like my song? It was really nice. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm not going to drink anymore. Ever again? Well, not tonight. Not today. Yeah. I bet you could do it. I believe in you. How you doing? There's still like half a glass left in the bottle. Why don't you finish it off, man? Nah, I'm good. You'd really like it. Well, I need to drive Listen to this later. peer pressure, man. I need to drive yeah, later. Yeah, you should probably be sure you're not Drunk like this. Driving? Yeah, exactly. Where are your lands? You got me, my dude. You got me. A bottle of what? A bottle of red. A bottle of white. All depends upon your appetite. Everybody likes the old Italian restaurant. My dad. Does he like it? Michael, he loves it. It's oh. his favorite. That's cool. Is it? Oh, they just creep and chilled me? That's creepy. And chili. Creepy. And chili. Creep, creep, and chili. Creep, creep, chili, chili, creep, and chili. That's good. Yeah, get down. <laughs> get down, my dude. Are we just dead. I'm never dead. Put that dude in the garbage can. Sweet Michael B's. Ba -ba -da. Blocking with my amalgam. Ba -ba 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 Can we just cast Pig next turn? No, we don't have enough mana for that. Mike's Petting Song. Mike's Petting Song? <laughs> oh god, he's so drunk right now. Is he? You can barely hear it. Can you hear yeah. it? Oh gosh. Gonna pet this cat too. <laughs> God. Oh, you're getting him in there with this gentleman? Alright, I'll block it. And then what? You can bring it back? That seems bad, right? Whatever, I don't care. Mike should do a kid's show. Hey, everybody, there's a little kitty cat here. Oh, we're going to pet that kitty cat. Hey, there's a little doggy here, too. We're going to pet that doggy. Frank, you forgot to put Ilharg in the deck. God damn it. I, I knew I was missing something. Looks like I'm one boar short. And Mike is two sheets to the wind. What does that saying even really mean? I get it means you're drunk, but like, Let's look it up. What's the origin of it? Two sheets to the wind. What does it mean? Most likely derived from nautical terminology, which a sheet is the rope that controls the sails of the tail ship. If several sheets or, or ropes are loose or mishandled, the boat's movement becomes unsteady and difficult to control, like that of a drunk person. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, who would have thunk it? Sailors, probably. Oh, you're right. Oh. We need life here. Land would be good, so we can obs daddy. Who's your obs daddy? I hate these lands wow. so much. I really just dislike them. It's gonna be a y y y y yikes for me, dog. They have that abrupt decay of stupid... One one flyer. You can do whatever you like. I mean, maybe. Feels Batman. I like that they did that now because now they don't get back their amalgam this turn, so that's nice. If they're just holding Creeping Chill in hand, we're just dead, so that's unfortunate. Just three, right? Yeah. 
You don't have reach, huh? Okay. I'm out of black. <clears throat> I mean, it doesn't save us from crippling chill, but it does save creeping chill, but it does save us from dying next turn to these same flyers. So, and let's see if you have it. They always do. Wow. I really hate Blooming Marsh. It's just coming out. Well, the Scryline's going to come in and play just as, just as tapped. Like, I'd rather just have a land that comes into play untapped. The seven drops feel a bit greedy? I mean, there's only two, two cards, but like we're... This will draw them like once. I think it's fine. Yeah, I mean, we're trying to ev Eldritch Evolution into them. Theoretically, we draw enough lands to actually cast them, but... Lol. A bottle of red. A bottle of Mike. Is Mike okay? Uh, he had a whole glass of uh, Lagavulin, so he's a little... Like, this thing filled all the way up. There was some ice in it, but... You know what? I'll keep it. Two lands. Oof. And an evolution. A little rough. I guess we draw an overrun to his hands real good. Overrun? Overgrown? Oh, did you say if we draw an overrun? <laughs> overrun team? That's not a same. <laughs> That's not a same? Is it's that not a same? Name? Same? No, 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 no. Name, name, same, my dude. Cool. My LGS has Pioneer tomorrow. I may just build the deck using cards I haven't got. I think that's actually fine. Oh, there's Spencer and Sing. I suppose that uh, I suppose I just got here. Oh yeah, gotcha. Oh yeah, I got you. Why wow, they hit this? they hit nothing but one Narcomiba. Everything else is pretty much trash. Why do you have to do this? <laughs> my name is Michael. Did you guys, to him. Did you guys even know that my name was Michael? Guys, my name is Michael. Oh, guys. That's how you sound. <laughs> Y'all need to check this new Weezer single end of the game. If you haven't, Weezer is still killing it almost 25 years later. I have not heard it. Man, where my black man is at, boy! I guess we just evolution here, right? Get a... Uh, uh, get whatever we want. Might just be questing beast again. That guy's good. Don't hate it. That's good. You shouldn't. Like, none of their creatures can block a questing beast. Oh, good, a creeping chill. Waka, waka, waka. Do you know who does that? No. Enzo the Muppet. Is that true? It's not a lie. Damn, what if we could evolution into Kalidus? Mm, that'd be pretty good. Kalidus seems okay. Wow, what are they just... Murderous cut? Oh, dang. Oh, dang, Daniel. Dang, Daniel! Why can't that be a black mana? I don't know. Because... Because the game hates us. Sweet Caroline. Ba -ba -da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
It's gonna pass here. We're just gonna be like Rhino, 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 Rhino. Birdie, Birdie. The old double block, eh? Yeah, I'll take three. Get this guy off the board and trade two for one. Woodland Beller could be good. We could get an old fashioned. An old fashioned. You know, an old fashioned, Michael. Your mom gave me an old fashioned. An old fashioned what? An old fashioned what? Do we want to play Woodland Beller? Or do we want to. Yeah, we want to play this because we can get a Skoos. Or a uh, Autumn. Or an Autumn. Scavenging goose coming Excuse down. Me, I mean, we can just eat all their nonsense and gain some life. And next turn, we can play Siege Rhino, gain two, gain five total, as long as we survive this turn. We what might do you not. Think we'll do. No, we're probably not going to. Well, the deal's three in the air, so we're at six. Double creeping chill. We don't have the mana for that, though. You're right. God, you're really doing some analysis here. You're doing some heavy lifting analysis here, my dude. I don't know why they attacked that guy. Because like they want three cards in the graveyard. Oh, right. That does that. Yeah. I mean, Narcomy was good, but... They got the quad Narcomebes. Dang. That's a lot. Wow. Well. Now we're at three. That's true. That's pretty good. Can we even play it though? I don't think it's better than just scavenging this, yeah. Can. Make sure it's a creature. It's literally the prize amalgam. Oh, getting aggressive, huh? Well, they only have one ground guy, so. That's true, I guess. I mean, I feel like if we can untap and yeah, if we'll we can survive here, we'll be okay. Like, they only have two cards in hand, so. And we're going to eight. So they can put us to four, in theory. We haven't seen any removal from them, so. I think our Siege Runner is definitely going to live. You, th you think that? That ground guy is lethal if they remove the Rhino, though. Yeah, but we haven't seen any removal out of them, so. That's not lethal. We can actually exile a creature and go to eight, so. Yeah, we've seen a murderous cut, but, like, I don't know how many murderous cuts they have, and they have two cards in hand, so, like, it's... At some point, we have to take a risk, like... I just fixed my basement door, manly man, checking in. Oh, man. Oh, man, manly man. Despair. Until they turn, creatures you control gain menace, and whenever this creature does combat damage... Oh, I didn't know they could actually cast that from the graveyard. I thought this was just a split card. Nope. It's actually pretty good here. Well, we discard a card. We discard Siege Rhino, I guess. That's fine. Oh, they all have menace. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. So, I guess we're going to eat... Uh... Gurmag Angler. The menace part seems like the most relevant. Yes. But they're gonna put us to one. And we're gonna have to lose the. Oh, never mind. They're not attacking with everybody. Well, you got it. So long, cards in hand. What can we draw here that gets us out of this pickle? Elder's evolution would be good. That's not bad. It's not great though. I guess it doesn't block any of the flyers. Um, six. They just block both of these. Actually, is that terrible? No. That's actually really good. Yep. So now we go... One, two, three, four, five... Blood Baron, exile the other, 
driven despair. So oh, just... Why? Okay, never mind. You okay? Yeah. And so now we're at three, but we take two from the flyers, and we have a blocker for the prized amalgam. So again, just hope we don't die, I guess. And they have creeping chill because yeah. they never don't have fucking that. So like, even if we gained three life with with this instead, we'd still be at six, and then they would just kill us with these guys. I mean, I don't know. That's really obnoxious that you just have this in hand every game when we're at three. Um. Yeah. What are you gonna do? I don't know. What are you gonna do? Like, I'm trying to figure out, like, if we didn't play this guy, we attack with one fewer guys, but then, like, three, this is five, so we literally have to use all three green to go to six if we want to survive both Creeping Chill and the two flying attackers. So that means we can't play this, and we can't exile the Driven, uh, so then we, like, they're still gonna have Driven to give Menace, so we have to have two blockers back. So I guess we could have just attacked with one, but if we just attack with one, they have a third Narco Amoeba, so we're still dead to three Narco Amoebas and Creeping Chill. So, like, there's really no way around this situation, unfortunately. We just, like... Yeah, I think we're dead no matter what. Yeah, they just have to have it, and they always do, so... <clears throat> Blueing Marsh, you're terrible. Uh, two Woodland, three Sun Petal, one Isolated. Maybe, like, one more Swamp, actually. Just having more basics for these cards. Last Hope could be good. I agree. It's just the problem is that we're just running out of room. I think Ferals might be too cute. Like, there's a lot of cards that I've seen. I feel like we, they've just done things. Last Hope seems good in this deck. What's Last Hope? He Just the one he just said. Liliana. Liliana. The Last Hope. Oh, okay. I... Part. Might be able to take one charming prince out. I think we just haven't been able to utilize it. But the, the scry has been helpful. Yeah, I don't like cutting that. You don't like cutting it? No. Okay. So we want two drops to get. You know if green drops. warden's worth it? Green warden has been fine. You like Liliana the last hope, but you don't like green warden. What's the? Is there a card that gives neg one neg one? Does plague mare only give it to white creatures? I don't think so. Uh, creatures are running control get neg one neg one. Ooh, I like plague mare a lot. I can see that being good. Maybe one in the main. Sure. Yeah, that seems good. No, unfortunately, Birds of Paradise is not in the format. That'd be sick. Oh, I'm gonna shut this off. This is getting cold, man. Good lord. We haven't evolved the Hornet Queen or Boar yet, but I don't think that makes them worse. I feel like its deck does need more lands, though. The problem with Goose is, is that we're like we're gonna have to cut four whole cards for a Goose package. I think the deck is good. Are we two one with it right now? Or one? Uh, we might be one two. Oh, wow, well, one two? Are we? Well, you can check, right? Yeah. We are 1-2. Yeah, that's what I thought. Who did we, what did we lose to the other match? I literally am blanking on what this other match was. Oh, it was just two dredge decks. That's why. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Flipness is alright. Uh-oh, it's magic. You know... I mean, Jade Light Ranger, I think, is better than Flip Nissa, though. It's close. I think Jade Light Ranger is just as likely to get a land, almost. I almost don't like Murderous Rider in here. Why? I don't know. You know, Bobby? I don't know. Mm, Bobby... Nah, color screw hasn't been a problem. Our only problem has been like drawing, Draw, not lands. drawing enough lands. Yeah, it's literally yeah, color screw has not happened. So, I think we're good on that.
Yeah. I think cheap is better on the list since you can evolve into it. Yeah, that's true. The old passage, I don't think we need it. We also have Rook Decay and Assassin's Trophy. I don't think there's that many Planeswalkers that really need I'm going to take Murderous Rider out. Because we don't really want to evolve into a Murderous <laughs> Rider as the thing. I'm going to add one more land. We can play like one Murderous Rider. What, why? What's the point? Just take a good card. Solid. Meh. Okay. I'd rather have another Jade Light Ranger to hit lands. Okay. Like, I feel like if we just hit our lands, why not once upon a time? Again, because we have to cut four cards. We're not going to play, like, one once upon a time. The Gaming Champ. Thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Like, I don't want to be cutting whole whole play sets of cards just to add once upon a time. Also, like, we don't want to hit creatures in the deck. We want to hit, like, Eldritch Evolution. So, like... I don't know. The deck wants to tap out every single turn. We have three drops, four drops, five drops. So, like, it gets to a point where, like, you don't actually care what like specific creature you're getting you just kind of want to be playing big things yeah all right we'll give it a we'll give it a go we have 25 lands and extra jade light ranger now so <clears throat> i keep checking the time man it's barely time for seven o'clock yet you got i'm three just checking hours. for text messages you nerd oh from todd no from the poker chat todd is in the poker chat michael you're right he is so you're just checking for todd not necessarily he could show up though Todd's going to show up at our house? No, I mean show up in the chat. Oh my god. He don't know where we live. It all depends upon your appetite. Alright, well, let's see if this... Uh, we got 1-1? One, one? Maybe it's just trying Prince to make sure we hit a land. Let's do that. Let's be a little more aggressive. At. I don't know if it's aggressive. Uh, I mean, aggressive. Oh, fuck. God, the Shrine doesn't even hit anything. I want to keep both these on top either way. Yeah, I still think we keep it. Against any red deck, like going voice land into night is good. You're right. Relax and Sam, your name ain't Todd. Oh my God, Katie, I didn't even see you in the chat. I'm so sorry. Hello, my dear. Oh, they didn't even attack? That's interesting. Whose name is Todd? Whose not name is Todd? Todd the Poker Boy. <laughs> His name isn't Todd. What a liar. I wonder if the Wild Growth Walker package would be reasonable in this format. Probably. Hmm. Just because you say your name is Todd again doesn't mean your name is Todd, Sam. My name is Jeff. I'm gonna kill this because your dudes don't need to be getting plus two plus two. Really, yeah, that's probably correct. Really, that's probably gonna gain us more than four life in the in the short term. In the long term, you mean? Short term would be gaining. Short term, life. the long term, any terms you got, and then we're gonna gain more life than that. <laughs> All way. the terms you got, I'll take them. Big terms. That's what they used to call me in college. They'd be like, "Hey, yo, what a big terms!" And I was like, "Why do they call you that?" Because of my big terms. Okay, I, I understand. You, you'll never understand. You know why? Stop kicking that thing. Man. No, I'll kick it as much as I That's want. That's rude. It has a family. Does it? Yeah. I don't think so, man. So, I think we do want one more green source here. Because look at this. Double green, double green, triple green, double green. I think we're actually way we ahead. We have a lot of green source. Don't we have like 18? I think it's like 15. We still want one more, okay? Is that good enough? Okay. Excuse me? You're disgusting. What are we eating, man? What do you want to eat? I don't know. You know what they say, toddliness is next to godliness. <laughs> they do say that. I want a salad bar, man. A whole salad bar? Yeah. I want to get that good, good salad bar, the sweet tomates. Ah, oh, you're out of control, my dude. Well, I hope this works out for us. It seems like it did. This is why we can't. I, I don't understand. This is ridiculous. Well, see you later. Any. Going to get your nails, did? Nice. I do that all the time. Go get him. He, look at this. Double green. Double green. Okay, we can play that guy. Double green. Double green. Green. Wow. I'm glad they conceded because we'd probably beat it. One, two, 
3, 4, 5, 6, 79, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. How many white sources though? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. In black we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. You want a double salad bar? Is that what you said? I may have said that. What the hell does that mean? That's two salad bars, buddy. Actually, technically, Sweet Tomatoes does have two salad bars because there's one on each side. So I guess wow. it has everything I want. Are you going to go to both sides? Yeah, man. I'll go to first side, get a, get the salad. I'll eat it. Second side, get another salad. Are you going to eat that one too? Yeah, man. Wow. Crazy, right? Guys, you heard it here first. Hashtag two salads. <laughs> we added a, f a 25th land. Sure. Yeah, oh boy. Yeah, we're gonna cut some white, okay? Take it easy, plea boosh. Dang it. Get on my dang nerves. Some white, you only have one double white card. I guess that's a good point. I just I just responded to that. Well I responded as well. You can't make me not. You can't make me not. You can't make me not. Michael B, Michael B. You can't make me not. Michael B. I no longer enjoy your company. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's only a matter of time, I guess. You can't make me not. I got my nails, dude. Hop out of bed. Got my flippy floppies. And my Michael... Ugh, I got nothing here. I think we're just going to replicate this. Can you stop messing with your phone? Can you fuck off? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. You lose your phone all the time, man. I don't want to hear that. No, I don't care about answering it. I care about the noise you made. You can oh. look. You can answer it all you want. Well, that's what you need to say. Increasing land by one doesn't make your percentage that much higher to draw. False. False, Katie. False. Is she, what is she, a doctor or some bullshit? Do I want I mean, to... Not that much, but it is somewhat. Do I want to block Brock this with a with a knight next turn or do I want to erupt decay it now? I don't know. What are you doing to your nose? I had a sneeze that wouldn't come out. Did that get it? No. Well, well, why would you I hate that feeling? I hate you. I'm going to actually keep this up because if they play Legion War Boss, I don't want to be like, I'm hungry. Can you cook me something? Probably. Can you get it? Mm, probably not, though. Here comes Legion War Boss. Oh, Ravel Master? Even better. Yep, that guy's dead. Get him. I don't think you want to bro Brock anything. Oh. <laughs> Why not? He's got all the good Pokemons. You know Brock? Who dat? He's the friggin' trainer. I said who dat? I'm telling you. Tell me again. I didn't tell you the first time yet. He's the Pokemon trainer. I might have went with counter. You know what Brock's favorite Pokemon is? The rock one. The big rock one. What's the big rock one's name, Michael? I don't know. It's Geodude, my dude. No, that's the small rock one. I'm talking about the long one that's like a snake with rocks. It's Rock Snake, my dudes. Onyx, there you go, yeah. Iggy? Iggy? <laughs> Who's Iggy? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> okay, did you just make that up? Iggy. Wow. Oh, dang it. That would have been good. Was it spelled O N Y X or spelled O N I X? I think it's Y X. You want to go to the salad bar, my dude? Yeah. I want a salad bar, my dudes. It is salad bars day, my dudes. I want you to stop talking. I want you to stop living. Is that a thing you can do? Wow. So harsh, man. That was actually a little dark. I apologize. I don't want you. Please don't stop living. No promises. What? Jack? What? <laughs> <laughs> what can we get with this Elders Evolution? Oh, wow. We can get a bunch of good good smoking stuff here. Smoking? Smoking! Are you ready? We can yeah. get... Oh, God. Are you ready? Oh, wait. Hold on. It's not that good. Dang it. What were you going to get? I was going to get Tulsimir, but then their guys are big. So it might just be better to play Knight of Autumn here, kill their Obelisk. They have one card. I think that's probably best. <laughs> I just want to listen to Fleetwood Mac. Can we do that? Suppose we could. So who am I? 
Just waiting for it to end. It'll never end. <laughs> this is the thing that never ends forever. He danced till he died. He's dead now. He truly danced. Uh, that's a little dangerous. I'll just kill it. Well, I'm definitely blocking this guy. Okay, I'm liking it more. Slam that big fat obza daddy. No, we're doing. He can't defeat the obza daddy. <laughs> Are you getting Blood Baron? That's pretty good. No, I was actually going to get Tulsimir. Or Blood Baron? Yeah, because Tulsimir gets to kill this guy. And we gained three, and we got two three threes tell on the board against their three. Tulsimir, tell me I'm your father, is what you just said. I said, tell me of your father. Tell me of your father? That's yeah. even weirder. Is it weirder? Tell me about your father. Who dat, who dat? Obzid Are you talking about Obzidat? Was that an Obzidat reference that you made three minutes ago? Look, they can't even do anything. Oh, now we're getting the lands. One. A two, a three, a four, a five. They're dead. We're at 18. Yeah, this game's this over. This game's over. We're actually at... Nice. Yeah. But on that note, I think that's where we're going to leave this deck. This deck was sweet. Jay Sizzle, thank you so much for the opportunity to, to, to play this deck. I really appreciate it. Um, I am actually thinking of revising my, uh, my deck critique pricing, where it's like usually I default to 50 because that's just the best way to not get swamped with decks and if you guys are trying to support the channel anyway it's a cool way to get something out of it but like i think i want to revise it so that if you guys have been subscribers for a long enough time or you know a set amount of time you get a discount and then a set amount of time you get another discount let me know what you think about that and uh because then you know and it encourages you guys to like if you guys are subscribing if you guys have subscribed for a while it's a cool way to get a discount on that and not have to like pay full price every time or whatever but um yeah and also, like, it gives me things to play more frequently. So, Pleboosh, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. But also, if you guys want to have your decks critiqued by me, definitely shoot me an email at frank at franklaport.com. You can find my info in my Twitch profile and the YouTube description below. So, check those out. And um, I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you later. <laughs>